everyone, today I am back with a new video and today's video is going to be huge boots haul. Recently I went to Boots and I did quite a lot of shopping. I bought a lot of products and I bought some hair care, skincare and makeup products today which is good. And yeah, I don't think there's anything else to say so I'm going to get started because if not this is going to turn into a really long video. The first bits I'm going to show you are makeup bits and I put them all into this tub. And I actually cannot believe how much makeup I've bought recently, it's crazy. The first brand I'm going to start with is Bourjois. So the first thing I bought from Bourjois is a blush. This is the Little Round Pot Blush in Rose Amber. And this is so beautiful. So this is the blush and it, is it not just the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? I really want to thank Sophie, who's my pen pal, for recommending me this. Um, it is just gorgeous, so I love this. This the first thing I bought, and I believe this is $7.99. other thing I bought from Bourjois is this, and this is the 123 Perfect CC Cream, and I got the colour Ivory. I've heard so much about this CC cream that I thought I'd just try it. It's got three pigments in it for like, colour correction. There's anti-fatigue, anti-redness, and anti-dark spots. And yeah, I'm really excited to try this. I believe this was £9.99. And then at the time of buying it, they had a free gift when you spent £15 and I spent £15. So I got the free gift and inside there was this, which is the Maxi Delight Bronzer in 02. And this is really pretty. As you can see, it is absolutely massive, um, but it's really pretty. And it kind of reminds me of the chocolate bronzer do want to buy this it is £8.99 which for this size I think is brilliant so also in the little free gift was this this is a kabuki brush and I think you can actually buy this I think it's worth £4.99 it's just really nice and I love little brushes they're like really handy to have so I was very happy when I got one the last thing is the bits that I kind of mainly wanted to get the free gift for and this is the Colour Boost Lip Crayon. This is in the colour Peach on the Beach and it is a really pretty peachy pink colour. And so many people talk about this and that is why I really wanted to try it. And I believe these are six or seven pounds ninety nine to buy. The next brand I bought from is L'Oreal. The first mascara I bought is the False Lash Superstar Mascara, which I believe is their newest one out. And I have used this in my first impression space video, so if you'd like to go and see that in kind of a bit more depth and what the brush looks like and stuff, then I'll leave that video in the description. I believe this is £10.99 to buy on its own. And then I also got this one, which is the Double Extension Mascara, and my nan loves this, and has been using it for years and years now, so I thought I would try it, and this was worth £11.29, so to get two for £12 is a really good deal. Also on the offer, I got two foundations. I got the Lumi Magique Foundation in Rose Pearl, and I used that in the first impression space video also. And then I also repurchased my True Match foundation in Ivory because I ran out of this and I really like it. And this is worth £10.99 and this is worth £9.99. And then I did also buy this um, on its own, which is the Infallible 24 Hour Matte Foundation. And I've heard so many good things about this, so I really wanted to try it. And this is a new colour porcelain. The next brand I bought from this collection, I've bought so many of their products recently. The first two things I bought are eyeshadow palettes. The first one is from the Eyes Uncovered range and this is the Nude Bronze palette. This is absolutely beautiful. So this is what the colours look like. They are absolutely gorgeous. My favourite colour is Ember which is this really pretty kind of peachy pink. And then the other one I got is from their collaboration with Little Mix and this is the All About the Eyes palette. This one I have actually used and my favourite colour is Dazzling Brown. I love that colour. I bought two of these and these are £3.99 each. I also bought this which is the Gorgeous Glow Block and this is number one which is the blush one and I've been eyeing this up for so long so I just finally decided to buy it. Um, so that is what that looks like and as you can see it's just beautiful. I love it. Something that is a little bit boring that I bought from collection is this and this is the Press Powder in the colour Candlelight. Um, I just was in need of a new powder and this one was only £1.99 so I thought I'd try this out and I did use this in my first impressions face video as well so if you'd like to go and see what that looked like then I will again leave the video in the description. Another quite boring thing is a repurchase of the Last Imperfection Concealer in Fair. I love this concealer and I've been needing to buy a new one for ages and they never have it in stock in the local one that I go to but they finally had it in stock and this is £4.19. Something that I was a little bit surprised to see in Boots is this, and this is the Collection Fast Stroke Eyeliner. 
and normally you could only buy this in Superdrug but they newly released it in Boot. When I saw this I had to buy one and this was only £1.99 and again I did use this in the First Impressions Face video so I really would suggest watching that if you are interested in what all of these products look like on but I love this, it's really really good. The next thing I bought is a lipstick and this is the Lasting Colour Lipstick in Rosewood and this is a gorgeous brown nude colour. This is what the lipstick looks like, it is absolutely gorgeous, um, I really love this. Finally from collection, I actually got this as a free gift and it is the Bronze Glow Mosaic Bronzer in Sunkissed and this is so shimmery. If you don't like shimmery bronzers, do not go for this one. Um, I think I might actually use this as a highlighter because it is so shimmery. I don't know if you're going to see that, but it's ridiculously shimmery. Um, but yeah, it was in a free gift and I think these are $2.99 normally. The next brand I got some things from was Natural Collection. I only actually bought two things. Uh, and the first one is a Blush Cheeks blusher in the colour Pink Cloud. And I've been kind of wanting to buy this for ages, but it was one of those things that I just kind of forgot about. And this is really pretty um, and I think this is going to be a lot nicer for summer because it's a bit brighter than my other ones. And this was only £1.99 and these are amazing, I love these blush cheeks, I have a few of them. And then I also got a lip gloss because they were on £2 for £3.50. And I got the Juicy Lips Lip Gloss in Caramel Shortcake and this is really really pretty. Um, it's a lovely kind of pink nude colour and it smells amazing. Oh, it smells like berries, it's really really nice. Next brand I got some things from is Seventeen. And the first two things I got from them were brushes. I got the eyeshadow brush and the powder and blush brush and I did actually use these in my first impressions face video so if you'd like to see kind of how I use them and how they apply products then again I'll put that video in the description. Also from Seventeen I got the Stay Time Concealer in Extra Fair and I got this because someone who I'm kind of friends with I'd say on Instagram and she also has a blog called Hannah um, I will leave the link to her blog and her Instagram down below. Um, she said that she prefers this to the um, collection one and I really like the collection one so I thought I'd try this one. So that is why I bought that and I believe this was $3.99 or $4.99. And then the last thing I bought from Seventeen, Eyeshadow Mono in Statuesque. And I have one of these in Rose Quartz and it's absolutely gorgeous. And I saw this colour and I fell in love with it, it is beautiful. As you can see, it is a gorgeous, like shimmery pink colour. And these eyeshadows are really pigmented and really beautiful, so I really recommend these. A random purchase for me was this, and this is the Smashbox Primer Try It Kit. And I actually found this on the clearance section for £5 which I thought was amazing. Inside it comes with the Photo Finish Lip Primer, the Photo Finish Foundation Primer and the Hydrating Under Eye Primer. And although they are all minis, obviously Smashbox is a high-end brand, so these are all worth a lot more than £5, I'd say. The next thing I got is another repurchase, and this is from Rimmel, and this is the Brow This Way Gel in Clear. Um, yeah, I recently came to the end of my other one, and I really like this brow gel, so I just repurchased another one, and this was 3 99 and then I also got a lip liner because I've been looking for this for ages and this is the Lasting Finish 1000 Kisses Lip Liner in Spice and this is a kind of said dupe for Max Whirl and unfortunately I don't have Max Whirl to compare it but I thought I'd buy it anyway. The next things I bought are from Revlon. So the first thing I got was a mascara and this is the Photo Ready 3D Volume Mascara and this is actually worth £10.99 so to get two things for £10 when this is £10.99 is obviously a really good offer so I really cannot wait to use this, I haven't actually opened it yet so I won't show you the brush. I bought three Revlon lip butters because everyone talks about these and they are like a cult favourite but I haven't actually had any up until now so I really wanted to try them. These are normally worth £7.99 each if you do want to buy them on their own. The first colour I got is Juicy Papaya and this is a really pretty like peachy corally colour. The next colour I got is Peach Parfait and this is a gorgeous shimmery pinky peach colour. And then the last one I got is called Sorbet and I'm actually yet to use this one but this is a really gorgeous bright blue toned pink and I love this kind of colour at the minute so I thought I'd buy this one. The last thing I got from Revlon is one of their Ultra HD lipsticks and I got the colour Rose. Um, if you would have seen my first and second space video you would have seen me apply this. It's just a really pretty light pink colour and I really like the formula of these lipsticks, they're really nice. The next thing I got, and this is the last makeup product, and this is a lip balm and this is the Burt's Bees Lip Balm with Coconut and Pear. This smells so nice. 
Oh, and it's just a clear lip balm. Um, yeah, I never tried these before, but I'm really happy I did because they're really, really good. Um, this was £3.89, I think. That was all the makeup stuff, and now I'm going to go on to the skincare and hair care stuff. So the only skincare products I actually got was this, and this is the La Roche-Posay um, FFR Anti-Blemish System. And in here you get three, I think they're full-sized, they look full-sized products and this is a six week supply so that's really good um, inside you get the purifying foaming gel the clarifying toner and the Epicar Duo Plus and I bought this because it was oh, I think it had a third off and the Epicar Duo Plus is so raved about and talked about for people with blemishes so I thought I would try this out uh, because I don't have like loads of blemishes but I do have quite bad blemishes when I get them. I don't have like major acne or breakouts and things but I do kind of, I am prone to the odd kind of spots and so I thought this would really help and if not it's just a really good um, set for oily skin anyway so I thought I'd try this and I think I paid about £20 for this. Okay so moving on to hair care, the first two things I got are a shampoo and conditioner. These are the Organics Coconut Water Shampoo and Conditioner and um, I just really like the sound of these. These were £6.99 each which is quite a lot really but they sounded really nice and they just they smell really nice, they smell like coconuts um, I won't kind of go too in depth with what I think of these yet because I am planning on doing an empty series so hopefully if that goes to plan you'll see it in that and because that was on 3 for 2 I also got this which is the coconut water weightless hydration oil and again this also smells like coconut so I think this is a really nice little set to get in time for summer so this should have been £6.99 and I got it for free. I also bought this, which is the cutest thing ever. This is the John Frieda Beach Blonde CUA Sea Salt Spray. And I got this because I like the idea of salt sprays, but all the ones that I've tried smell just really horrible. And I don't like the smell of like actual product in my hair. So this I think I'm going to like because this smells like coconut. I'm really excited to try this. This was £1.99. And the full size is £6.99. I was really tempted to get it, but I thought I'll try this little one first. The last few bits were, are really random, but they were on clearance. And I find that Boots do this every summer with their hair care products. And I don't know if it's because they are kind of getting ready for new releases or new packaging or things are discontinuing. But there often are just a couple of little things that are all on clearance. So I found a couple of those things and I bought them. <laughs> So these next few things might seem a bit random, but yeah. So the first thing is the VO5 Nourish My Shine Miracle Concentrate. And I think by the looks of it, this is just a kind of hair oil. And I think I paid no more than a pound for this. So I'm really excited to see how this goes. I've never really tried anything from VO5 before, so hopefully this is good. Also from VO5, I got a packet of the hot oil... Um, treatments and in here you get four 15ml treatments you can use one a week so this should have, in theory last you four weeks which is quite a good um, amount and I've heard quite a lot about these and apparently they're really good you kind of use them when they're hot so you put them in a bath with you or put them in a cup of hot water and they're just supposed to be really good so I'm looking forward to trying these and again I pay no more than a pound and then the last one, which I am so excited to try, this is the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Light Awesome Molly Deep Treatment Mousse. And I thought this was going to be one of those things that you put in your hair and then blow dry it. But it turns out you actually put this in your hair after shampooing as a kind of all over treatment. And then you wait 3 minutes and rinse it out. And it's supposed to give you volume. So I'm really excited to try this. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. I actually cannot wait. And I believe this, I paid about £1.50 for this. And I love Aussie products. So hopefully this is good. Okay, so that was everything. I hope you all enjoyed this huge boots haul and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.